Good-natured and adoring, Persian cats are well known for their long, streaming coats and round, pansy-like appearances. As one of the most perceived and well-recognized cat breed in the world, Persian felines have been joyfully cuddling up with their owners since the 1600s. With their long, streaming coats, thick bodies, and level faces, it's difficult to resist the Persian's cat charm. Persian felines are a medium-sized cat breed and play their job as a caring friend genuinely. They're prepared all the time to be stroked and gotten all worked up about on a second's notice. This delightful kitty arrives in a wide assortment of tones and shading combos, and they coexist with all relatives, counting individual fuzzy ones when presented as cats. If you're willing to invest the time energy with grooming your Persian cat, and it's a great deal of work trust me, you won't find a more loving companion. In today's video we will talk about everything you need to know about the Persian cat. Also, subscribe to the channel if you're interested in getting useful tips and guides about your dogs and cats that will make you be a better pet owner. Let's dive in. History of the Persian Cat Nobody knows precisely when or where the absolute first Persian feline turned up, yet during the 1600s, these long-haired delights were being brought to Europe from advanced Iran, which was then Persia. By the 1800s, they were brought into Britain, where early forms were shown at the Crystal Palace Feline Show. Queen Victoria looked into the breed and possessed a few during her lifetime, including one she named White Heather, who stayed in Buckingham Palace after the Queen herself had passed on. The Queen's connection to these caring felines helped make them famous with the British public. The first Persian cat arrived the US in the late 1800s. In 1906, they turned into the first cat breed enrolled in the Cat Fanciers Association. By the 1950s, particular breeding began to produce the Persian cat with a more flatter face and rounder heads. In view of their majestic background and old lineage, Persian felines have played featuring jobs in art, publicizing, and photography as the decades progressed. Truth be told, the biggest painting of cat at any point sold, named My Wife's Lovers, portrayed both Persian and Turkish Angora cat. Today, Persians are one of the most well-known cat breed in the U.S. appearance. There's no mixing up a Persian cat when you see one. These notable cats are notable for their thick fur garments, enormous eyes, and stocky bodies. However, there's one feature that quickly strikes a chord when you think about a Persian's appearance, their adorable, smooshy faces. These felines are a medium-sized variety, with female Persians weighing between 7 to 10 pounds and males at a somewhat bigger 9 to 13 pounds. That long, glistening Persian coat arrives in a large group of tones, including orange, gray, and cream, and their eyes are regularly a splendid copper, green, hazel, or blue. Throughout the years, two types of Persian cats have arisen the show in the conventional, otherwise called the cutie pie. Show Persians, additionally called peak face, since they take after Peck and G's dogs, usually have flat faces, more modest ears, thicker coats, and bigger eyes than the traditional. Doll-faced Persian cats have less articulated highlights and all the more intently take after the primary recorded pictures of the breed. Regardless of whether your kitty is a peak face or doll face, both offer a similar sweet disposition and require day-by-day -day brushing to hold their long coats from matting temperament. Persians are however sweet and also sharp. These calm, elegant beauties are walking love wipes whose fundamental reason in life is to adore you and be loved in return. Each feline is an individual, and that implies that the singular cat probably won't show the personality ascribed to Persians, says Marilyn Krieger, certified cat behavior in San Francisco. As a rule, Persian cat are known to be relaxed, social, and friendly cat who love to be close to their individual, petted, and snuggled. Persians are cheerful and inquisitive felines, yet they won't make you insane snooping about your home searching for cups of water to push over. In addition, Persian cats are determinately built, so they're probably not going to endeavor climbing the curtains. You're probably going to find them snoozing on the comfiest cushion they can find. They likewise coexist with everybody, including dogs, as long as they are mingled when young. Persians are adequately strong to enjoy cat toys and games, however, don't bother with steady amusement to keep them happy. Living needs. Despite the fact that they might appear as those style models, 
Persian feline consideration doesn't include any extravagant facilities. Truth be told, this medium energy breed will be similarly blissful in a small loft or huge home. Like different cats, Persians will enjoy a cat free to get on, yet relying upon your singular pet, it probably won't be fundamental not these cats are too athletic, and a few Persians should keep each of the four paws immovably on the ground or on the lounge chair. They enjoy lying in a sunny window, so adding a comfortable rooster too will permit your kitty to babble at birds in solace. Since they have such sweet characters, Persian cats make extraordinary pets for all individuals from the family, particularly seniors and older children. If there's an agreeable lap around, your Persian will track down it. When in doubt, Persians additionally coexist well with dogs and fellow cats. Care. For their lavish coats to remain in excellent condition, Persian cats require day-by-day -day brushing to forestall tangles and mats. Brushing and combing will likewise eliminate excess hair, dead hair, and even cat litter that may stick to their fur. Bathing is fundamental to keep your Persian's jacket and skin looking great. Expert tip, if you begin bathing your feline when she's a little cat, she won't mull over being set in a tub of warm water when she's a grown-up. Assuming you've taken on a grown-up Persian, she probably won't be so able to scrub down, so you may have to fall back on spot cleaning with a warm, damp material. Welbing. The run-of-the-mill Persian life expectancy is 10 to 15 years. Similarly as with any breed, Persian cat are defenseless to specific medical issues, and they do have various potential hereditary medical problems that potential owners should know about. Two normal afflictions in Persian cat incorporate moderate retinal decay, pra, and polycystic kidney sickness, peak AD. Peak AD is an acquired problem that causes little, fluid-filled sacs in the kidney tissue that develop and duplicate over the long run, ultimately prompting kidney disappointment. Pra is a hereditary eye illness in felines, where the cells of the retina fall apart over the long haul and ultimately lead to visual deficiency. Eye and dental issues are additionally an issue for Persian felines, as per the American Animal Hospital Association, particularly those with complement faces and short jaws. Normal regard for these areas will keep your feline in better welbing. Also like other cat varieties, Persian felines ought to be spayed and neutered and should never free wander outside without close management. Dental disease. Dental illness is one of the most widely recognized ongoing issues in pets who don't have their teeth cleaned routinely. Tragically, most cat don't take excellent consideration of their own teeth, and this presumably incorporates your Persian. Without additional assistance and care from you, your feline is probably going to foster possibly genuine dental issues. Dental illness begins with food buildup, which solidifies into tartar that develops on the noticeable pieces of the teeth and at last prompts contamination of the gums and tooth roots. Ensuring your feline against dental disease from the beginning by eliminating food buildup routinely may help forestall or defer the requirement for cutting-edge treatment of dental infection. This treatment can be upsetting for your feline and costly for you, so preventive consideration is gainful in general. In serious instances of persistent dental disease, your pet might even lose teeth or support harm to inside organs. If you enjoyed this video and you would love to see more amazing videos on your dogs and cats, subscribe to the channel, give this video a like and turn on the bell notification icon. Thanks.